Good morning everybody, Olav here, and welcome back to Carmageddon. Now, um, because it is election day, we have a very special Carmageddon. Uh, we are going to go back to Main Street, we're going to try and, we're just going to roam around killing people, mostly because of this nice little feature that they have in this, this particular game. Um, Really, really like it. It's it, it looks like it's fun. I haven't actually played this version or this 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 mod yet. Uh, this was actually this is actually included in the game, so that's kind of cool. Uh, but yes, let's. Uh Two, one, go. go! All right, let's go. So yes. Yes, if you notice, <laughs> we have uh, we have Donald Trump and Hillary Clinton, and they bleed the colors of their party, which is kind of an awesome thing that I did not realize was there. So yes, um... So yeah, um... We're killing the presidential candidates today. Why? Why not? Self-abuse? I do not like that. Um... But yes. Uh, we, we, there, yeah. Uh, there's, there's just... Clintons and and Trumps all around. And I think somebody blinded them. <laughs> Boosh! I'm gonna take your gun. <laughs> Ow. Thank you. Jackass. I need repair. Okay. Come here, Trump. And Hillary. I'll kill you both. I don't care. Two shit candidates. I have no qualms about... I, I have no qualms about playing this version. This is... <laughs> this is kind of therapeutic if you... If, if you hate... If you honestly hate both candidates. Yeah. Oh, great. Now I have lunar, l really lunar, uh, lunar gravity. Great, which means, yeah, this is just gonna suck. Okay, I think that's done and over with now. now of course, the question I have is, um... Boosh! <laughs> just... <laughs> oh, I love it, I love it. I do, I love it. It is just beautiful. It is a beautiful, beautiful thing. Even the people in the wheelchairs are. Ah, there we go. Okay, so now we have an upgrade token as well, which is good, because uh, I don't know. Yes, they are. Uh, all of the the football players are the candidates as well. <laughs> so yeah, we're just like going through and just murderizing. If we do this, now, 
if we do this, does that mean that, uh, does that mean that we get a redo on everything? <laughs> I just love all the little random quotes. I don't know if you can hear them or not. But yeah, it's just like there's all these like random quotes from the candidates. And yeah, it's just it is it is just a beautiful beautiful thing. It is. It is just beautiful. Uh, so yeah, this is, you know, with this and like the surgeon simulator that we did yesterday. Yeah, this is just Yeah, just kind of having all kinds of fun Whoa I do I just I I, I love the 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 different blood The, 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 I, I, I find, I do find it kind of interesting, though, that, um, that, uh, Trump's is not actually, um, Trump's blood is not actually red, it's orange. I don't know if they're kind of saying, oh, well, with his, with his general, you know, the, the fake tan that he's got and stuff like that, that, oh, well, you know, yeah, it's, he's just kind of an orange guy all around. Oh, where'd you come from? Where were you hiding? What the hell? Dude, is that, am I just like gassing? I don't know if I was just like gassing everybody or what, but oh no. You know what, I, I have learned to avoid those. Okay, so I did like drop a gas bomb then. I have learned to avoid those, uh, the little, the, the, the gray thing, the gray, um, the gray tabs. Ooh, another one. Okay. Upgrade points are good things to get. Upgrade tokens are basically what you use to, uh, to get, um, to pay for your upgrades and stuff. So generally you want to, if you see them, you want to grab them. Because that's just... So now I've got three upgrade points. I don't know if I've actually unlocked any upgrades yet. But yeah. Now there's 780 people and only 74 of them have been killed so far. So, is this the next checkpoint? No, it's not, okay. I suppose I haven't actually successfully beaten this yet. Ooh, wait a second, I can steal his. If I kill him, I can steal his stuff, yes. That is right. I will totally steal his car. So yeah, I mean, there's a lot of people. There's a lot of people to kill in these. Uh, so going through and killing all the pedestrians can take a lot. Um, now going around and just, you know, going through all the checkpoints and stuff like that, eh, that's a little bit easier. Checkpoint. 
So I think that's what we'll do from here. I mean, it, we'll, we're not gonna we're not going to, to to hesitate running down some presidential candidates here. We are not gonna. Well, I have uh, I have no reservation about that. Hi guys! <laughs> I love that. I just love that. It's just like yeah, <laughs> mow them all down. Yes. Thank you. So yeah, I have no idea how we're doing as far as the actual, like, an official race. I don't know if everybody's, like, taking my my lead and hunting people down. Or if everybody's, like, actually trying to win the race proper or what. Or if they're just, like... Waiting in the waiting in the uh, the the side alleys and stuff, waiting for me to, to to drive my happy ass by, and they're gonna try and take me out. That's entirely possible. I would not be surprised if that's what they're, some of them are doing. So we're on lap two of five. So yeah, I mean it's it's not too bad, especially once you know once you get the the. Oh, way too fast. I should have known that. I know you don't want to go at that one really, really fast. All right, do a minor repair here. Yes, there we go. Dude, I just took her head off with my tire. That's awesome. I... I so love this game. I am so happy that they didn't, like, abandon this game. What the hell's going on? I'm taking you out, Trump. I mean, I gotta, gotta get you back into the, the operating, you know, the operating room somehow. Gotta give you another heart. That, that stone heart's not gonna last forever. So you want to slow down here, otherwise you are totally going to fly off and right into that, that hot sauce? Oh, that's right. She did. She was going on about how she always carries hot sauce. I, I, I do not keep up with politics. I personally hate politics with a passion. So, yeah. As far as a as far as political type stuff, this is about as political as I get. Kill them both. Let's have a redo. That's that that is my political stance this year. Is especially for the presidential candidate. They're both shit. And yeah, so that's 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 my political. That's, that's my take on modern day po politics. Is, yeah. We have gone on with the less, vote for the lesser of two evils long enough. More than anything, what we need to do is we need to, to, to get control of our political system back and open it up so that we don't have just two, just two candidates. I, that's that's got to be my that's that's like my biggest pet peeve is the two-party system has kind of you know really has kind of limit you know pretty much you know made it so that a third-party candidate can't you know can barely get into any of the debates so they're not viewed as so a lot of people don't view them as actual as an actual, you know, as an actual contender, and if your if your opponents don't, I just saw another uh, upgrade token here, so we'll take that. 
Ow. And drive into a pillar, yes. Uh, but no. My, my biggest concern is, like I said, we, we have a two-party system that is maintaining, that is those, and both of those parties are determined to keep it a two-party system. And I think that's kind of bullshit. Especially when you have a situation like this where you have two of the most disliked candidates ever. It's, it's, it's a load of crap. It's a load of crap. And more than anything, you know, as much as the, the parties say, oh, well, you know, it's the, the problem is, is, the, the, is that other party. No, the, par the problem, the biggest problem that they see is not a, is not, well, that other party wants to do this or this or this. It's, we don't want a third party that's going to be somewhere in between to, to, to have a chance. We don't want them in the debates because they're going to take away from our candidates. We don't want them on the ballots. We want to make it next to impossible for them to get on the ballots. The United States political system is really geared towards maintaining the status quo of we have two parties. We're going to we're, we're always going to have two parties. And that has brought us to, you know, and that has really is what brought us, has brought us to our current situation where, you know, like I said, we have two shitty candidates and we have to choose. And it's like, in terms of this game, that's like deciding, well, okay, are you going to get run over by me or are you going to get run over by the guy that's trailing behind me? It's your choice. You have a choice. You have to make your choice. Make your voice heard. Be, decide between which which one of us kills you. That's kind of how I view the presidential election. Not to mention the fact that, honestly, all of the candidates say they're going to do all these great and wonderful things, except for the fact that they can't just do them. The president isn't that powerful, guys. They have to have... You know, they have to to be approved. You know, the, their plans have to be approved by Congress. So you really want to you really want to make sure that there's going to be change. You have to vote for, you know, you, you, the, the more important votes are your congressmen. Oh, that's what I was afraid that was. That's why I avoid the gray barrels. The gray barrels suck. We need... So, all right. So we are almost done. Kill one less Trump. One more Trump. Take, there, there is now one less Trump. And <laughs> just smear his guts everywhere. All right, so we won. And that's my little political rant and um, my, 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 uh, yes. So we did steal Cutter. Uh, we stole Cutter. We, we, we talked about politics on our election day. And we killed a lot of the candidates. <laughs> like a lot of the candidates. Which I'm okay with. In in relation to the game, not like actually going out and murdering somebody. Don't go out and actually try and assassinate one of the candidates. That's just not a good thing. I do not advocate murder, other than like fictional video game murder. And that is all the time we have for today. As always, thank you guys very much for watching. And stay tuned for more. From Olaf Productions. If you want to see crazy and also lazy, then you should meet me and my friends. Because they are attracted to noise. And that's the thing with these zombies. I don't think they're attracted to light. 
I don't think all the torches we have. We successfully performed a heart transplant on Donald Trump, giving him a true heart of stone. If you've seen half the shit that he's done to people, you'll understand why. <laughs>